And welcome back, everyone. We have all been warned about being careful not to click on suspicious links in emails, text messages, or social media. But what do you do if you accidentally click on one and get hacked? Uh, Karen Stiles from our Call for Action office has some tips on how to protect your information and limit the damage that could be done. Most of us are pretty careful about not clicking on links in emails, text messages, or social media. But if you accidentally click on a link and notice something is not right, here are a few things that you can do to minimize the damage and protect your personal information. As soon as you notice something is wrong, disconnect network cables or disconnect from Wi-Fi. Check for viruses and malware by performing an antivirus and malware detection scan of your computer or device. If you have not done a backup in a while, back things up as soon as possible. Change passwords and usernames. If it appears that one or more of your accounts have been compromised, contact your bank, businesses, or agencies and ask for their help in protecting your account against fraudulent activity. For more information about phishing scams, visit FTC.gov. All right, Karen, really good tips there, actually, because, you know, like she said, we all try to be smart, but man, these things are getting more and more sophisticated and you could accidentally click on one. <laughs> right. I mean, it, sometimes, too, it's like preventative measures. I mean, when was the last time you changed your password because you were thinking, OK, I should just stay on top of this? Uh, every day, of course, Susan. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> if you are running into a consumer problem and not sure where to go, start with our Call for Action office. They're there to help you. You can contact them using the information right there on your screen.